things and it let me know what y'all going through. Sometimes I go through things, I gotta go through things and kinda let me know the temperature out there. So I already know what's on the people's heart. <clears throat> you feel what I'm saying? But I wanna let you know, yeah, you're going through bad things, you're having your hard times, but rejoice in that because I'm gonna tell you something. Yin yang. Six, nine, good, bad, negative, positive, up, down, so within, so without, as above, so below. What am I saying? I'm saying it, if, if it's bad shit happening in your life right now, it's inevitable that good shit is going to happen. Because the universe is balanced. It'll be out of balance. So yeah, you experiencing and all this fucked up shit. I don't know what's going on. Yeah, you you got demoted. Yeah, the car got repo. Yeah. 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 I mean you done going through so much bad shit now that you done damn near left your body now. You I mean it don't even matter. Because what I'm trying to let you know is some good is right around the corner but see it's important for you in these hard times for you to stay calm because blessings is right around the corner this is your testing period this is your testing period this is your testing period so when you're going through those bad things just know okay yeah I'm being tested and blessings is right around the corner but it's greatly dependent on my actions right now. The outcome. The outcome. You got the power. The blessings is right around the corner. You're going through that fuck shit because the blessings is right around the corner. The devil, the septicons, whoever you want to call that force, know that. So the goal, the objective is to trick you out your blessings. Don't get tricked. But see, you don't need me to tell you this. You know that in your heart. That's why some keep nudging at you when you want to snap and say, ooh. That's what that is. You know that. It's in your heart because you got direct access. You don't need me. It's cool. You know what I'm saying? This brotherhood. We got a community on here. Me and Sharp and me and we family and everything like that. But you don't need me. You got direct access to the universe, to God, whoever he is to you. You got direct access. You know what I'm saying? If you will open up your heart. You know what I mean? But you also got me too. Warning do come before destruction. You know what I mean? And I ain't gonna be long winded. I've been on this. You can call it the series, the episodes. Whatever I say, I'm, I'm going through it. I'm experiencing it. So I, I ain't like I'm getting on here and I'm telling you to do some shit that I ain't doing. I'm telling I'm saying some shit. You know what I'm saying? I'm telling you, getting some tips how to overcome some shit. And most of the shit that I say is, is shit that I experience. And this is how you get through it. You know what I'm saying? And I've been on this shit, man, saying, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Don't blow your lid. Blessings is right around the corner. The devil's trying to trick you off the street. The devil's trying to trick you out your blessings. <coughs> I know if I'm going through this shit, people out there going through it way worse. Way worse. But see, everybody ain't going to make it. But some of us could if we had somebody tell us it's a trick it's a trick but then again like I said you have direct access to the supernatural power the supernatural knowing you know that when, when you want to blow your lid when it nudge on you but sometimes we get possessed so greatly that we just snap but if you're hearing the sound of my voice I want to let you know that the man upstairs, the supernatural power, the universe, when it let you know that you can just hold on a little while longer, it'll be worth it. It'll be worth it. 
It'll be worth it. It'll be worth it. Don't snap. Don't blow your lid. It's right around the corner. You just get tested before the blessings. That's all it is. That's all it is. So if I can leave anything with you, I want you to know that when you experience bad things, just know, okay, yeah. Blessings right around the corner. This is how I want you to think. This is how I want you to program your mind. I'm going through bad shit. The tire just got flat. Car just got repo. Lights it. Car, I just got fought. I'm going through bad shit. I'm going to stay positive. This is the time I'm really finna connect and get positive and deposit some good shit in my spirit because I know blessings is right around the corner. And I know that the outcome is greatly depend on my actions right now. Like, for, for example, I'm going through a hell of a lot of shit, man. A lot of shit. A hell of a lot of shit. And been applying for my own, own apartment. I'm living at a space going through shit. I've been applying for my own, but I still got to go through this shit when I'm trying to get my own. You know what I'm saying? But I said, you know what? I'm going through all this shit. I'm going to prepare. I'm going to act like I know it's coming. I'm, I'm calling it. I done got rental insurance. I done got electricity. I, it's already set up. Because if you stay ready, you ain't got to get ready. What I'm trying to let you know is blessings around the corner and that prepare for it. The minute you start going through that bad shit, you know blessings around the corner. You know the devil trying to trick you out your blessings. Then we're going in within and we're preparing ourselves for our, for our blessings mentally and physically. Because it's on the way. Blessings on the way. Play this shit back, man, and really understand. And hear what I'm telling you. Don't get tricked off these streets. Your blessings is right around the corner. Prepare for it. Prepare for it. A man should have no more than he know what to do with. Prepare for it. Prepare for it. It's right around the corner.